This is what a customer would typically see, which is a map of the facility, and the doctor would see, or well, take me to uh, Miss Smith. Let's see how Miss Smith is doing this morning. And again, the doctor's not driving at all. The doctor simply chose to uh, go to see uh, Miss Smith. And remotely, our Vivita goes automatically to Miss Smith's bedside. These are not real people, so we're not uh, hurting care or infringing on anyone's privacy. And, and once, uh, once we're there, we can have a conversation uh, with the patient. If I need to zoom into the patient and have more of a one-on-one -on -one conversation, I can do that. So this, this place is in the context, while well, roaming the hallway, obviously, it's, it's a little bit hard to imagine. So let's say, and of course we can check uh, Ms. Smith's vitals. Um, and if we decide now that, okay, we're, she's doing great, let me go talk to uh, Mr. Jones. Um, I can just select Mr. Jones' name off my list. And this is integrated with the hospital records. Who knows which patient is in which uh, bed at any point. Uh, and here I am at the point that was selected for me to talk with, to see how Mr. Jones is. Looks to yeah. Mrs. Jones. <laughs> yes, yeah, she, she doesn't look to be doing that great. <laughs> um, and that's when you can talk to the nurse. So let's say right, we have a question. Let's go uh, back to the nurse's station and see who's who was on duty there, and just talk to the nurses about something that we saw that needs attention. At that point, you may engage the privacy handset that I showed earlier. You just want to have a private conversation with with the nurse. Um, so here we are in front of the nurse's station. The nurses would be sitting at the, behind the desk uh, or at one of the computers and we could have a conversation.